Joan, thank you. Now at six, a murder mystery on Miami Beach after a woman's body is discovered in front of the Miami City Ballet. Tonight, a source tells CBS News Miami she was beaten to death. CBS News Miami's Peter Dench has been at the scene all afternoon long and has been talking to people in that area. Peter joins us live from Miami Beach. Peter. Well, Elliot Lauren, a source tells us that the woman had major trauma to her face and may have been homeless. The security guard made the discovery here, according to that source. Police got the call just after 6 in the morning. The woman's body was discovered in front of Miami City Ballet. A source tells CBS News Miami that she had been beaten to death. Laureen Bonet, a tourist from Paris, used her cell phone to take these images from a scene she will not forget. I was shocked because I, uh, I, I was just uh, walking here. It's my last day. It happened at 22nd Street and Liberty Avenue. For Andrea Seymour, who has lived here on Miami Beach for 15 years, it was a somber sight. It's shocking, because that doesn't happen around here. It, it doesn't. That's shocking. Does that mean for a woman it's unsafe to be here? That's scary. Police say the woman they discovered was unresponsive and was pronounced dead on the scene. Daniela Tobara, a substitute teacher at nearby Miami Beach Senior High School, came to the scene after hearing the news and that the victim may have been homeless. It's really scary, to be honest. As a woman, um, like, I just feel like we're... Every, the world feels like it's growing a little bit more hostile sometimes. But the fact that this person just has this rage that they took out on this woman to the point where now she's not even here is terrifying. Miami Beach Police spokesman Officer Christopher Bess called this case a top priority. We can state that we have every resource in our criminal investigations division boots on the ground and actively looking for the subject. Best was not sure if any weapon had been recovered or if there are any witnesses. Our organization is very confident that we'll be able to identify and arrest the subject responsible for this heinous crime. However, we will not allow any rock to be left unturned. Now, both Miami City Ballet and the Miami Beach Regional Library next door have surveillance cameras. It's not clear if they captured the suspect. Police say they do not have a motive so far in this case. But if you can help, call Miami Dade Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS. There is a reward in this case of up to $5,000. We are live on Miami Beach. Peter Nench, CBS News, Miami.